G'day everybody, welcome back to the channel and I'm going on another hunt and can you guess where I am? Yep, you guessed right, I'm back down the old campgrounds. So I thought I'd come down here for a couple of hours. I'm going to head over to a little corner section in the, uh, in the area that I've been hunting and I have found a couple of older coins there as well. So I'm going to set the detector up again. I'm hesitant, I don't know whether to set it up at 20, 20 and above or maybe keep lower numbers like 16, 16 and above. I'm not sure. Uh, I don't want to be just digging rubbish the whole time. And 20 and above probably cuts out a lot of, a lot of garbage. But anyway, let's get geared up. Let's get over on the, on the campgrounds. Let's see if we can find some more treasure. Right, yeah. So, I haven't, I've got the detector set at 20, oh sorry, 19, actually it might be 18, I'll just double check that, so it's at 17, 18, maybe I'll take 17 off, yeah, sorry guys, anyway, so it's at 18, anything 18, but where I'm going to go, is around or basically straight ahead where the trees are past this shrubbery bushy area so i'm going to go up and i'm going to hit all in amongst all the trees okay so got got something down here and i think it did say one bar let's see pull out this beast Get rid of this, because that. Right here. Get that out. Right here. So there you go, 1920, it's a double ring pull, crazy, should just keep 20 and above. Alright, second target, bottle cap, okay next target down here, one cent coin, little one center. Now the sun's out, it's fucking hot, getting hot as buggery now. Alright, next target down here was a 28, got it. Battery. Must have been there a while to go like that. Okay, next target I got. And that was ringing up a 19. I just thought I'd dig it. So what I'm going to do now is just change these settings. I'm going to increase it to 20. Get rid of 18s and 19s. Because all they are is rubbish. So, still can't get over how bloody nice of a day it is. It's about 19 degrees. No clouds in the sky. And hopefully it stays quiet. For the next couple of hours anyway so i had a signal down here it was in the high 20s now i've just pinpointed it to this this little patch here so i'll just see i'll try and get this angle right off. ah look at that it's like a washer a little washer what a good sound oh well Must be made out of stainless steel, perhaps. So there you go, a little washer. Hmm. All right, guys. So I had a signal up up near the bushy area. So you got like the campsites here, backs up to these bushy trees. It was a high, high tone. But have a look at that. One penny. It's a Commonwealth penny. I don't know if you can see the day, I can't, it's too bright. But yeah, so one penny and it was 
I dug a little bit in here, but it was sitting right on top. It was almost, almost like it was just sitting on top. Alright, uh, well, I'll have to hunt the edge here then. That's where the old coins are sitting, by the look of it. So, one penny. What's that, 1934? Okay. Uh, yeah. Pity it wasn't a 1930. Oh well. Rightio, guys. So, found that penny around the corner there, in the grass. And I just was having a hunt here. As you can see, there's a hole. With good reason, too. Here's this florin. Just found a florin. Not sure of the date, can't see it cleaned up. I'll click get we'll get it home and have a look at the date, but I'll just do in here and see if there's any more little hidey holes in here. Any more treasures hiding, but there you go, there's a silver. You beauty. Alright guys, so what I'm doing is found a flower in there. I'm just slowly working the edge of all this brush. And just here found a one cent coin. So I'll just keep going along and see what else we can find. Right, yeah, so I just got the one cent coin down there, swung it over here, and I have a signal, but it says it's pretty shallow. So, right here. something yeah it doesn't sound good actually sounds like a can oh, oh. oh shit fucking can all right he's an old bloody spaghetti can Ooh no wonder it was ringing up funny in the 30s all right so i'll show you what i'm doing guys so I'm just on the edge of the bush. Ah. That's going to be another bloody can, I would assume. Oh, hang on. What was that? No. Ah, oh, this bloody jacket is in the way. Seriously. Oh. Looks like an old treasure map. Take that. Now I need the pin corner again. Shit. There's the lid to the bloody skin. Great. Well, at least they buried it all at once. Alright, so what was I doing? Okay, so. This bloody jacket. Oh! Okay. I'm get some digger behind. So. I don't want to bore you guys, but twenty-one, twenty-four, mm. thirty-one. Ugh, okay, let's see what that is. It's gotta be something. Thirty-one. Oh. 
loosen it all up and we'll get the pin corner out. Try and I'll find it and I'll show you what it is. Alright, so sardine tin, that was about a foot deep. It took me ages to find it. I didn't think it was that deep. But anyway, that's all gone there. So I'll keep hunting, see what else we find. Alright, next target. One of these little foot things. Rang up pretty good, 25. Rightio guys, so probably got about half an hour left. I'm going to stay here. I do want to head over there into that green grass area. But I was just doing a few of these campsites. So I've noticed on the knocks when you're going from grass to sand to leaves, it sort of chatters, it beeps, like it must be ground discriminating. So if I get out there in the grass, hopefully it won't do that too much to me. But anyway, I had a coin uh, signal down here and it was a two cent coin. So, yeah, another one. Alright guys, so I sort of come through these trees here. Had a couple of targets, mainly rubbish. Um, so I didn't record it, but I'm going to head straight back down this green area. And then uh, take off after that. But I had a signal down here. And we got ourselves a first gold coin for the hunt. Now, usually there's a crap ton of these gold coins. There has been in the last, in the initial hunts that I did, but I got a feeling I've got them all out. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll just, there we go, perfect. We'll just head back, head back towards the car now, just across this green paddock. And if I find anything, I will record it. All right, only got three steps and I, Got a target down there, we've got another brown coin, one center. All right guys, um, that concludes this hunt. Started to get a fair bit of rubbish at the uh, towards the end of it. Lots of cans, a few cans, and uh, yeah, just even that last, there was last, last target that I dug, it was a 22, 21, 22. But it was just a little lid so I didn't bother didn't bother recording that anyway let's head off home for the wrap see what we got Rodeo guys made it back home from the hunt and it was such a beautiful day today blue skies no wind I think it's going to turn tomorrow anyway let's check out the finds Rodeo so as you can see a fair bit more trash today on this hunt we did find Fair few cans, especially in the sandy areas of the of the campsites. So you got a VB, Pepsi, but well, look at that, something else there, Forex, I think. And then we found an old old tin can, probably someone's soup. Looks like a sardine can there. Uh, just the lids. And yeah, we did find a tube of God knows what. I can't even be bothered. Not sure. Cream. Zinc cream, maybe? And then uh, this looks like a battery to me. I don't know. It's bloody, it's pretty hard. You can't, you can't bend it. It's really stiff, but it looks like a battery. Initially, I thought it was a cartridge, gun cartridge. A little bit of plastic. Did find this chunk of metal. Pretty big chunk of metal. We got bottle caps. Some of them might be old, I don't know. And then just some various little bits of metal. Uh, this looks like one of those feet things. Or oh, maybe not. Actually, that looks familiar. Oh, actually, it's a washer, I think. Like a hose tap washer. Maybe. I don't know. And pull tabs, we've got... Someone's actually tied these two together. Oh, look at that. The bloody thing was ringing up, I think, a 20 on the 
on the knocks we've got a little uh, metal lid or a little connection of some sort and this actually rang up a little tiny bit of metal and it was rang up like a 23 maybe and just a little bit of chunk of crap oh that's off this thing that's off this this big piece here and we've got the coins so we got one two cent coin three one cent coins we've got a two dollar coin a gold coin and the finds of the day we've got a 1962 florin there's a little bit of black crap in here i'm not going to worry about that 1962 and a 1934 one penny and it's actually got some detail on it. it's actually quite good well that side is anyway so that side uh, yeah i don't know i wouldn't i'm not going to touch it or clean it i've actually i haven't done anything to it i've just rubbed it with my fingers so there you go a couple of mold coins to add to the add to the collection Rightio guys, well thanks for coming along on this little treasure hunt. Back to the old campgrounds, still finding the old coins. Haven't, haven't found much jewellery, that's the only thing I haven't found there. You would have you would have thought maybe in, in previous times that you know, people would have lost rings and all that sort of stuff. However, the last two hunts I did set it at 20. So rings, you know, some rings probably ring up, ring up lower numbers, 12, 14, anything. Alright guys, I'm Chris, Indoors Outdoors with Edgy, and I'll see you guys on the next hunt.